Hello, I'm Richard, and welcome back to this section of the Shade Tree University, and this is the Grease Monkey section. Today, we're going to look at the vacuum system on this typical 1.9 turbo TDI diesel. A lot of people say there's no vacuum on a TDI. Yes, there is. This is the vacuum pump at the end of the camshaft. The vacuum pump runs the vacuum brake booster over here, which allows you to have a better braking system. This also will have a supply line that will go up and run vacuum up to the N18 and over to the N75. The N18 does two things. First thing it does is it runs vacuum and pressure over to this pressure valve here. It's a pressure, electronic pressure valve that will run the shutoff flapper on the inside of the EGR valve itself. The second thing that the N18 will do is it will run a vacuum line, also a large vacuum line, to a plunger inside of the EGR valve, allowing for air to flow in and out freely into the system, the intake manifold itself. Going back over, out of the N18, back over to the N75, you'll see that there are large lines going into the right side of the N75 and a large line going into the right side of the N18. These are fresh air supply lines to the system. That has to come from filtered air that comes out of the air box itself. So right side air supply, left side of the N75, again two things. The bottom one starts off large, is tapered down with a coupler, and it goes all the way back over and ends at the turbocharger over here. And that activates the actuator that opens and closes the fins on the turbocharger itself. Coming back over to the N18, you'll also see a top line. And that is a line that is fed, well, from the source itself. You'll see this line coming off of the actual vacuum line, coming off of the vacuum pump. It comes up, that line comes up into a little a T up under here, and it'll feed pressure into the N18, come off of that through a one-way valve, and come back to the N75 and supply pressure to that. This is a one-way valve, letting air in, but it won't let air out. That does two things. It keeps from having a, a boost in the system itself, but it also lets the turbo a uh, vacuum bottle, reserve bottle, have air to it. And what that does, this turbo bottle down here, this uh, vacuum bottle, will allow for an easy shutoff and an easy start the next time you start the car up. So again, that really is about it for this vacuum system on the TDI 1.9 turbo diesel. And I'm Richard Bryan. Hope you enjoyed this section of the Shade Tree University and the Grease Monkeys. See you next week.